Making money while you're sleeping doesn't have to be that difficult. All you literally have to do is close your eyes, imagine yourself making money while literally asleep, and then wake up and put that money to work. Hey guys, just Vice here. If you're new to the channel or you haven't hit that subscribe button, go ahead and do that to support the growth of this channel. Other than that, I hope you'll stick around until the end to learn four really easy ways to make some money while you're sleeping. I'll see you there. Now the first and most obvious option when it comes to making money while you're sleeping is investing your money. Specifically, I would look into dividend paying ETFs. Now an ETF is a collection of various stocks with percentage ownership in all of them. And sometimes if you're lucky, these ETFs will even pay you a monthly or a quarterly or an annual dividend just for owning it. So for instance, if you wanted to buy a couple shares of a tech company and then a couple shares of a consumer care company or even a couple shares of a banking institution, you could do that. But the total cost of all of these individual stocks will be far greater than what many of us can often afford. Rather than doing that, you can buy a ETF that combines fractional shares in all of these stocks. Through doing so, your ETF is diversified. You're able to hedge your bets in various parts of the market. And at the end of the day, you might even get yourself a dividend on a monthly or quarterly basis. Now, the second alternative to dividend paying ETFs are high growth stocks. So with these stocks and these companies in particular, it's the belief that there's still much room to grow. They haven't reached their full potential yet. And as an investor, you're able to capitalize on that potential, whether it's a year from now, 10 years from now, or even 50 years from now. I would argue with growth stocks, you might want to have a shorter time frame in terms of growth potential, but that's each person's sort of decision. And with these companies, you want to decide what type of um, industry you want to follow. So for instance, do you want to find growth stocks within the tech sector or the medical services sector or the fintech area? It's really your, at sort of your discretion. But with these growth stocks, the whole plot behind it is you're investing in their potential or their potential for growth. And with these types of investments, you can make money sometimes when they introduce a revolutionary product overnight and it's your decision whether or not you want to keep your interest and your stake in that company or if you'd like to sell and take your money out now the third alternative still sticking with investing is real estate now i understand many of us may not have the financial capital to begin uh, real estate investing but when you're thinking of making money while sleeping this is a no-brainer if you have the money and the financial capital to do so, or you can partner up with some of your buddies, your parents, or anyone that's willing to co-sign with you and you buy your first place, that property, if you are able to rent it out, or if you want to make a quick flip, will give you a significant amount of money. Whether you want to flip the property for a quick cash or you want to hold it out long term as a rental property, you're going to be incurring monthly revenue, which at the end of the day goes into your pocket. Not only are you making money off of the rent that's being paid to you, but the value of that property, chances are, if you've done your research and you've done your homework picking the property, that value is probably appreciating as well. So with real estate, if you can get a co-signer or if you have the means to do so, buy your first rental property and then keep building and adding to your portfolio over time because the value of the property increases and you're able to create a consistent flow of revenue. Now the fourth and most important one, which I'm confident will make you the most amount of money while you're asleep, is investing in yourself. Your growth potential and your output potential is only going to be as great as you're able to make it. So whether that's taking a course on a specific type of hobby that you wanted to pursue, or it's going back to school for furthering your education, or just reading another book, it's going to be as simple as starting because that's going to help you get up to the next level. If you wanna become a realtor, go take a real estate course. If you wanna become a lawyer, go and enroll yourself in law school. I know those two aren't that simple, but it literally starts with investing in yourself because that's going to help you level up to your next level of potential. 
with investing your money, with throwing it into real estate, with investing in yourself and buying different types of stocks, everything will definitely make you money while you're asleep. But it's at your discretion how hard you want to work for it. Making money while you're sleeping isn't actually that difficult. Investing in high growth stocks, dividend paying ETFs, real estate, and investing in yourself will definitely get you there. If you guys enjoyed today's video, don't forget to drop a huge thumbs up and check out the links below if you want to get started on investing. And until then, I'll see you guys next time.